Hi, this is a tutorial for Junk by Paul McCartney. Um, this is just a simple strum version. It doesn't have everything that the song does, but it's pretty close and it sounds pretty good to me. So uh, I think you can learn this in a day if you try. So um, we'll go through the verse chords first and then uh, the middle chords and just the different strum patterns and hopefully it'll give you enough to learn the song. Um, okay, so the first chord for the verse is an F sharp minor and that is your index finger on the third string of the first fret your middle finger on the fourth string of the second fret and your ring finger on the second string of the second fret then you need a C sharp 7 you're going to bar the first fret with your index finger and then your middle finger goes on the first string of the second fret. Uh, then there's an A. You put your index finger on the third string of the first fret and your middle finger on the fourth string of the second fret. And then a D major 7, which is barring the second fret with your index finger and then your ring finger on the first string of the fourth fret. It's a pretty cool sounding chord. Uh, then an A again, and an A sus4, which is just, you have the A chord, you just add your um, ring finger to the third string of the second fret. So it sounds like this. A, A sus4. Okay, so the um, strumming pattern is just down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down. That's. I'll do that in a second. So that starts on the F sharp minor. C sharp 7 and with the C sharp 7 you can just play it like that down up down down or you can add your pinky a couple of times to the first string of the fourth fret actually just one time so down on the up on the first up you put your pinky on that uh, that string and then take it off and then from the C sharp 7 you go to the A. That's down, down, up, down, to the D major 7. Down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down. A, A sus4. So it's... I'm just going to have to count that out. Um, then you go into the second verse, which is the same chords, F sharp minor, C sharp 7, A, D major 7, D major 7, D major 7, A, A sus4, A, A. Alright, and then we're going into the next part, which is the bye bye, says the sign in the window. Um, this is like a D, a D minor. With a, with your, you're gonna add your pinky on there, but um, it's your index finger on the second string of the first fret, middle on the fourth string of the second fret, ring on the third of the second fret, and then you add your pinky to the second string of the third fret. It sounds like this. Okay, so it's you take your pinky off to make it the next chord. So to just go down to the D minor. So it's down, down, up. So on the up, up stroke, so it's down, down, up, down, 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 up, down. So it's D minor with the pinky, down, down, up, down. And you're taking the pinky off, and then you go to the A chord, down, down, up, down, up. Then to an E chord, um, which is your, the only way I really can play this is, um, your index finger on the first string of the second fret and then you're going to bar 
the top three strings of the fourth fret with your thumb. A, that D minor again. Okay, so it's D minor with the pinky, pinky off to the A, to the E, to the A, the D minor, A, E, A, and then you go back into the next two verses, which is all of the same chords that we already did originally with the F sharp minor and the C sharp 7. Uh, and the A and the D major 7 and the A sus 4 and then it goes back into the uh, bye bye says the sign in the window and the only difference there is um, you're going to do the D minor to, this is to end the song D minor to A to E to A back to A this time, you're going to go to the F sharp minor, to C sharp 7, to A, and then just one ringing strum on the D major 7, give it a sec, and go back to D major 7 again, and end on the A to the A sus 4. to A, and that's it. So I can send you a chord sheet if you need it. Um, just uh, shoot me a message with your email and I'm happy to send that to you. Um, it's actually really easy and uh, shouldn't take you long to learn that. Um, and uh, if you have any questions, just let me know. Thanks.